Hi, I'm Rick Itzkowicz. I'm the LinkedIn guy. And in this video, I am going to show you how to um, connect or attempt to connect to a third degree connection. I got this question asked of me today, and I figure I will show you how to do that. So um, we're starting on the LinkedIn homepage, and up here you see there's a, a tab where you can do searches, in this case for people. You can do several different searches for jobs, companies, etc. So we're just going to leave it on people. And uh, the person I'm going to search for is a name by the name of Catherine Grennan. Somebody had asked me if uh, I had uh, if I had some connections to that person. So I did a search. And what happened was uh, Catherine was in my network. She was a third degree connection. Now what that means is that uh, I I'm connected to Catherine through two people. I have to go through two separate people to get to Catherine. So let me show you how it works. So when you click on uh, the name of the person that you're searching for, again, she's a third degree connection. And if I scroll, I'm going to see how I'm connected to Catherine. There's me over here. And then there are two people that are connected to someone who is connected to Catherine. So I could ask either one of my two connections to forward an introduction to one of their connections to pass it along to Catherine. So it is a little bit of a long shot for this to happen, but it certainly beats having no shot at all. So what I would do in this case is I would go ahead and uh, ask to get introduced through a connection. So you click on that. And over here, what you see is I have two people that I can contact asking them to um, connect me to Catherine. So let's say I would talk, uh, I would request this guy, Steve. And uh, what I would do is um, I would pass my message on to the person that I want to uh, contact, in this case, Catherine. But then I will also put a note to Steve that would help them pass the information along to somebody else. So uh, remember, you are writing a message to the ultimate person that you want to connect, but you also need to pass uh, a message to the person in between. And in this case, since Steve is not going to be the person forwarding it directly to Catherine, Steve is going to have to pass the message along to somebody else. So it's a little bit like playing telephone. Um, where one, one person is passing on a message who's passing on a message, something is going to get lost in translation by the time it gets to the intended recipient. But the clearer you are, the more that you will increase the odds that this could happen. All right, so that's the mechanics of how to uh, connect or invite to be connected with people in the third degree. I hope you found this uh, tip valuable. And if you have any additional uh, questions or tips, be sure that you connect with me on LinkedIn or send me an email at rick at productivelearning.com. Enjoy an extraordinary day.